All right, so I come in here to brush my teeth, just like anybody would do, and I find this Dobson fly who has trapped himself in the sink last night. And he was trying desperately to get out a moment ago, so I'm gonna grant him his wish before I take off. I'm just gonna kinda get this little guy behind the head so that he cannot get me with those very large mandibles of his. And we're just gonna take this little guy outside. and zoom my camera back out so you can see him now. And we're just gonna just set this little guy right here on the building. Well, he probably won't stay there. So we'll set him on the ground and let him go along his way. All right, interestingly enough, the Dobson fly from this morning has stuck around. He's still here on our camping chair. And the reason I say that that's interesting is because there's also a female who's right here. And you can see how much smaller the mandibles are on the female than those of the male. But don't let that fool you, because the ones on the male are large, but they're also awkward. So he can't really get me with them. But hers, being smaller, are much more controlled, and they can bite the living crap out of you. So we won't mess with her. But anyway, just thought that would be interesting. All right, have a Dobson fly larva here, and uh, you saw the adults earlier. This is the nymph or larva, and it looks like it's close to its final stage. It will molt, and it'll get wings, and it will be the winged Dobson fly that we saw earlier on. You know, he likes to live down by the river, and we're right here on the bank, as you can see. And uh, I had this little guy earlier. He looks like, as you can see, he looks like something off a journey to the center of the earth or something. He's got the same big, he's got these big jaws on the front. It's a pretty cool little guy. Not too scared of the jaws. He's not going to bite me as long as I don't stress him out. But uh, yeah, he'll transform into one of those flying Dobson flies. We're just going to let him go on along on his way.